Body Church. We're still here in Philippi and thought it worthy to send another brief message here. Behind me is the marketplace, and I'll get to that in a minute, but uh, we've come through the, the theater where Paul would have had his public apology made uh, after having been arrested as a Roman citizen. He never should have been arrested and imprisoned, but of course he didn't tell them he was a Roman citizen, so they didn't know. He's put in prison, and we saw the place where uh, the archaeologists think that Paul and Silas were in prison, and they sang hymns to God from that spot, and, uh, and the doors opened, and the chains fell off, and the Philippian jailer and his family get saved. Well, why was Paul put in prison? Well, the reason happened right here behind me. In the marketplace, he cast a demon out of a slave girl, uh, and she was a fortune teller, and after he cast the demon out, her abilities were gone. She was useless then and couldn't bring them any profit. So uh, they brought accusations against Paul and Silas and uh, beat them and took them in, into prison. And that would have all taken place right in this marketplace area. This is where Paul would have taught and mixed and mingled with the Philippians. So uh, I'm gonna step aside. You can see that the city of Philippi extended from, from here all the way to where the mountains are. And this is where Paul uh, would have introduced the gospel to Europe and the area where Lydia lived and where things began uh, in Europe. So I'll step out of the way and we'll talk to you soon.